Okay, so we're now going to look at getting a sub-range. Um, Java, you can't declare just a sub-range straight off, but what you can do is you can only make your loop go through a sub-range of the entire range of the enum. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, instead of making it loop through all of the days in day, I'm going to make it only use the days on the weekend, so effectively a sub-range. To do that, <coughs> I'm going to have to call upon the Java util. So I'm going to write Java dot util dot enum set dot range. Open bracket. I'm then going to call my day. I'm going to say day dot Saturday and Day dot Sunday. So I'm now only going to loop through my two days here. I'm going to change this just so it makes sense to say, um, in fact, I'm going to ignore that and I'm going to system dot out dot print and I'm going to print D. And I'm just going to comment out my other code so that it doesn't run and comment out that. Okay, so my code is just going to run now, so it should only loop and print the days of the week, but only in the range Saturday and Sunday. So if I run my code, Saturday, Sunday. Oh yeah, I didn't enter anything. So, um, have a go at that. The next task was to take the user input and decide if it was on the weekend or not. So, a couple of ways that you can do this, and I'm going to leave that up to you. You can have two for loops, one that loops through a subset of the weekend and a subset of the um, weekdays, or you could have it loop through all of them and then a loop inside that runs just for the weekend dates. So it's up to you to have a go at deciding how you're going to complete that task. Okay, off you go.